Hey, hey everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. Today I'm over at Carmel Cliff in the newest village of Red Point, and I'm taking a tour of one of these model homes. It's called the Vittoria. And they have four models, three are on display. And this one is 4573 plus square feet with five beds, five and a half baths, and three, or no, four car garage. So you have the garage here, and then this would be a garage from the model. This is actually my favorite model. I love this floor plan. The starting price as of today, which is September the 9th, is 1.2 mil. It could be more or less by the time you watch this video, but at the moment of day of recording, it's at 1.2 mil. So this is a nice little dining room, office, den, whatever you want to call it. And actually this is the dining room with a nice wine room. And then here's that third bay garage right here, which they did some epoxy flooring. Very nice. This is a, the largest of them all, 45, 73 square feet, five bedrooms. It's pretty cool. I like the stairways, stairwell, stairway. Done a TikTok video on this. Hmm, that light is bright. Let's see. I don't know how it looks in the camera if it looks pretty awful. This is a great floor plan. Now in these models, they probably spent 500,000, if not more, on updates. Like Toll Brothers, they spend around 100,000. I mean a million in the Mesa Ridge. They spent a million in upgrades. But I really like how this island is. I like these lighter cabinets with the black pools, the beautiful Carrera-like marble, but it's quartz. And they also did a different color in the island. Oh, this is sleek, very sexy. If a faucet could look sexy, that would look like a sexy faucet. <laughs> and the nice, I don't know what material that is. Very nice, so here's an overview. We'll take a tour of the whole house and then we'll take a tour of the backyard. We have the huge Sub-Zero refrigerator. All these appliances are upgraded. The Wolf appliances. I like this little butler pantry area with the wine fridge as well as the huge pantry. And then again, the dining room. I love these linear windows, horizontal. And this is either a gas or electric fireplace. Very nice. And then you have right here would be the office area, which would be entry into your garage. And then you have a half bath down here, which is pretty nice. But this is my favorite room. It's a nice exercise room. And it still has a closet. Obviously this would be a bedroom, a very large bedroom. But, well, if I could have a fitness facility like this, I would be in heaven. And it has access to the backyard, which we will look shortly. So now we're gonna head upstairs. The lot premiums here, they were, they did release recently like three lots and at that time the premiums were 100,000. I've noticed that as things go on, the market's slowing down, the premiums aren't as high as they were and it just depends on where the lot's located. If it's on the inside, the lot premium's not as big as if it was on the outer edge of the community. And I've noticed that they're opening more lots and the lots aren't going as fast as they used to be before. You'd have wait list. That's not happening anymore. It's beautiful. So let's get a 360 view of the loft area. And then we'll just head right here since we're here. I look rough. Don't, don't look at me now. <laughs> Out of breath. So this is a nice bedroom. 
And I think all the bedrooms here have their own private bathroom, which is really nice. Nice laundry room with a sink. Obviously everything in this house is an upgrade. I like this coloring of this room. It's just very girly. And also their own private little bathroom, which is cute. Very nice. I love the color of those cabinets. And this loft, very nice, has access to the patio, but we'll look at that shortly off of the primary. So then we go down this hallway and there's another bedroom, oh, another full bathroom. With another bedroom. you can make that bedroom downstairs that the fitness room into um, another primary bedroom as well this is the nice little seating area with a wet bar added extra and then nice windows beautiful master with separate sinks divided by a nice soaker tub beautiful freestanding tub with the gray cabinets and then the large shower with the rain head enclosed in glass. Very nice, very nice finishes. Love this tub and I love that the water faucet's right there. The beautiful quartz countertop, same as downstairs, I do believe in the kitchen. And I love all the black trim, super sleek, super sexy. And this beautiful custom closet the nice little island in the middle custom closets are not cheap so you can see why this is my favorite floor plan not only because of the layout but because of the views now obviously you're gonna pay a pretty penny to have your house right here and there's gonna be houses right in front of you or behind you, I should say. However, because this is so tall, you're still gonna have city views. Unfortunately, it's a little overcast out, or I should say there's a layer of smog or fires from California that you really can't see the strip, but it's a beautiful view. Then here is the view of the pool. Now these model homes won't be sold until they sell out on the community. So that's gonna be a little while. It's a very long patio that you have access to the loft as well. Very nice. I'll go downstairs and take a peek at the swimming pool. And just to surmise, if you forgot what model I'm looking at, this is the Vittoria over here in Carmel Cliff in the Red Point Village of Summerlin. And this home is 4573 square feet with five beds, three and a half, no, whoops, sorry, five and a half baths and a four car garage. It's pretty cool. Look at these steps. I don't know if I would want the dark steps just because animals and dirt showing. love this kitchen. Alrighty, let's go take a look at this backyard. Oh, I should have gone through that door right there. That would have been easier. Okay, so you have a covered patio and I would imagine obviously that this tile is an upgrade. It may come with pavers. I kind of like that they have this for security purposes. If you have children, it's a great feature. And 
the yard's not that big. It could be a standard 5,000 to 6,000 square foot. The most important thing is you can fit a pool in the backyard. So that wraps up my tour of this beautiful model over here. Um, if you have any questions, you know, leave a comment down below. If you're thinking about buying a model home in Summerlin, I am your, not a model home, but a new home. I am your local Summerlin expert. I'm your local new home sales expert. I've sold over 25 new homes this year alone. You can always give me a call at 702-370-5112. And I will see you guys on the next model home tour. Have a good one.